What's up guys, Harry here and welcome to episode 8 of Hybrid Domination. Today we're going to play a few matches because the previous episodes we did quite a lot of trading and I was just getting a bit bored of it. So today, as I said, we're just going to play a load of matches. The first team we came up against was a Silver Sirius slash Surrey B side. I think this was the Silver Tournament as well, the first round. Uh, we take the lead here in the 17th minute. It's allowed with a pretty good header off the corner, it got saved and then somehow uh, the rebound slips underneath the keeper. I was very, very fortunate to get that goal. He then runs through in the 20th minute with Quintero. I don't think that's the five star skill of Quintero. I think it's a different one. I might be I might be wrong though. Do uh, let me know if I am. But anyway, he takes the lead there. Oh no, he didn't take the lead. He equalised. Then he takes the lead here in the 45th minute uh, with Sal. I think that's how you say his name. And then uh, reiterates his lead in the 63rd minute with Sal again. I was quite annoyed here. Um, I felt I was dominating the player. Uh, play and I thought his goals were against the run of play and that's kind of my excuse for doing that dirty dirty tramp there uh, I'm, I don't enjoy doing tramps and uh, I hate having them scored against me uh, the only reason I did that is because I really felt as I said I was uh, it was an injustice that I was losing that game so I wanted to try and get back uh, it didn't pay off and I ended up losing the game 3-2 so I looked a bit of a twat in the end anyway we're heading to the seasons mode now um, I gave up on the silver tournament because I've realised this is going to be too hard if I can't even win the first round we came up against ACDC and Jesus Christ I thought I was going to get it easy easier in the seasons, but oh no, this guy's got an absolute tank of a team. The only player that might let him down is Tim Howard in goal, he's only going to have six chemistry, uh, so I don't really know what he's doing there. But Alessandri goes through in the 19th minute, uh, manages to outpace his right back, who I think was um, Arbeloa, I might be mistaken, but I think that's who it was. Anyway, uh, Alessandri finished it off nicely, and that means the guy decided to rage quit. Uh, for some reason, he like I don't get why people rage quit after one goal. Uh, I mean, look, the gameplay was quite, kind of even, like we're both getting even possession and stuff, so I'm not too sure uh, why I decided to do that. Maybe he was just in a bad mood or something. The next game we came up against was a French team or a whole League One team. Uh, some pretty good players in League One. Uh, Jimmy Brion and right mid out here is an absolute tank this year. On the stroke of half time, uh, Wallison got a goal. Scripting might have had something to do with that because it was his weaker foot and he's only got three star weak foot, so a very lucky goal. Then uh, moments later here, or not moments later, um, after half time, we tried to take it round the keeper, uh, but somehow the keeper managed to foul us. I'm not too sure how that worked out. Uh, but Marcos Asensal, as I said last episode, has great penalties, and I'm going to blast it straight up the middle. If I'm playing someone that doesn't look like they're much about Ultimate Team, I will always put it up the middle because that's where people don't often dive. If you put it any other place, there's there's always a chance they might get there. But up uh, straight up down the middle, uh, often people don't go unless they know what they're doing. Uh, he gets a, a goal back there with Lopez, uh, which is quite fortunate for him. But then again, this is the, the second disc connect in a row. I was praying that it wasn't me that got dis disconnected and uh, whoa, messed up my words a bit there. Um, I was praying that it wasn't me that got uh, Jesus Christ, I think I'm going to keep that in there because that's just funny. I was praying that it wasn't me that got disconnected. Luckily it wasn't, it was him. Uh, the next team we came up against was a full BPL side. Uh, he got five at the back, which was quite annoying. Uh, we go through a Wallison in the 11th minute, and with his weaker foot, uh, managed to kind of like stumble over the ball and get it into the back of the net. Very fortunate goal there. Uh, then later on in the 40th minute now, I believe, Wallison with an absolute thunderbolt on his right foot, which is his preferred foot. Uh, fantastic, fantastic goal there. I was very happy when that went in. Um, I didn't actually try many long shots with this team. I was I was trying to mainly do skills, because there's quite a few skillful players in there. Uh, but if I'd have tried a few more long shots, you never know. I might have scored some better goals. We played through Wallison here in the 77th minute. Uh, he brought his keeper out way too far, and that meant he could no longer use his hands. Uh, that allowed Wallison to just dink it over him with a pretty good header. I'm surprised he got enough power on that. It was quite fortunate. Um, here you see, I'm, I scored a pretty nice skill goal here. Uh, not the best, but uh, for, for my standards, pretty decent. Uh, very generic skills here. I can't really do any fancy ones. I can just do the uh, chop roulette. McGeady spin, that's about it really. Uh, but still a pretty nice skill run and I was happy when that one went in. I do a lot of skills with this team. Um, I do enjoy skilling with this team. Uh, Wallison and Kelvin are an absolute joy to use. Uh, but I only ever uh, show the highlights in this series. Uh, so you never get to see um, a skill run if I don't score at the end of it. Which is a bit of a shame. And I would like to improve with my skilling in the future. Because it is something, as I said, I really do enjoy doing. For our final game, we came up against this guy here. as a terrible team. Uh, like no chemistry at all and some pretty bad goal players. Anyway, we took the lead here with Zalau in the 25th minute. It. and this was a really strange game because I absolutely dominated like completely I was having shots all the time but for some reason I just couldn't score look at the stats here 25 shots 14 on target and I only got one goal uh, that's very frustrating but I still got the win I imagine if I'd have drawn it I'd have been so pissed and I'd probably called up EA and had a go at them but anyway that means we've definitely got promotion into division three I think uh, we need to play another game to win uh, the title but that is it for this episode I hope you guys have enjoyed sorry I messed up the commentary in a few places uh, but I hope you guys don't mind if you're going to leave a like that would be great uh, we haven't been getting as many likes on the last few episodes so if we can hit 50 that would be absolutely fantastic and i will see you guys next time